And I think she did it on purpose. That's what really made me mad. What's up, y'all? I'm Clee L'Oreal. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, hit the subscribe button. If you've been around the block before, or what's T Grow? So, I have some pork tips, red beans and rice, some yams, and macaroni and cheese. And we got a cute little apple pie over here. Mmm, to my wrap. So, y'all, I'm more hungry than I do have conversation, but not as much, but I'm real hungry, so we're gonna eat a lot first. I'm drinking V8 also. Mm -hmm. We gotta lubricate the pathway. Cause honey, we about to smear. So, <clears throat> excuse me. I kinda wanna touch on first dates. What you expect, you know. I mean, so, my first date with Bay Friend was at a park, y'all. It was super cool. Of course, I was just going off at the mouth. Mm. But y'all, we met at the mall, I met at the park. And it was cool because, mm -hmm. mm. oh man, this is good and spicy. Mm -hmm. It was cool because we were outdoor, we were around different people, and we actually got to like listen to each other versus going to a movies. I absolutely hate going to the movies on the first date. I just don't be understanding because you can't really talk. See, sit there and quiet. Well, let's just say the movie's terrible. Child, that's a long ass time. Y'all know when you go see movies at the movie theater, they be doing something to the movie when you're there for two more hours more. Honey, you be at the movies for three to four hours. Be, and I don't understand when the movie be an hour and 20 minutes. So they do something to y'all. You gotta be careful which movies y'all go to. Do some research it. So I ain't the only one. But y'all, this is so good. So these red tips came from, um, uh, mm, or pork tips, I'm sorry. Is that the same thing? I don't even know. It's called Alabama Q's, and it's in Mason. I mean, not Mason, but Clifton. Mm-hmm. That barbecue sauce, though, y'all. And I'm not a barbecue sauce fan at all. Uh -oh. Let's get into the apple pie. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Y'all got my size from um Popeyes because <clears throat> their size was a little shabby. Especially the macaroni and cheese, y'all. I ain't even going for him. Crash tastes better than that. I don't know what they was thinking. Mm-hmm. Mmm. They fatty. So y'all, I just had to do my hair like this. I, I got to uh, meet my teeth. It's a bonnet back here, y'all. <laughs> y'all wanna know if I ain't tell you? I put a piece of bonnet back there. I had some rollers <laughs> in the back of my head, y'all, and I didn't want to disturb them for tomorrow. So I'm going to the gym in the morning. I ain't got time. I don't know how I'm about to keep this, how it is tomorrow, but I'm just gonna pray to God he handles it. Cause I've been sweating. Honey, I went to sleep last night and I ain't putting no elastic band around my head. Woke up and I was using my wig as a pillow. I didn't know what was going on. I thought it was still in my head. Uh-uh. Slid right off. Mmm. This fool is bomb. Wowzers, I had to buy me a new cup. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. <sighs> okay. So, I had to buy me a new cup because my dumb self yesterday, <sighs> I was washing, before the McDonald's move bong, actually, y'all. I was washing my cup and <laughs> I washed it in like steaming hot water. And um, immediately after that, I took a pepper shower. Wiped it down and put some ice in it and put a drink in there. And it went 
snack crack pop. It was about to bust, so I had to hurry up, take it out. It was a um, smoothie, yeah. Mm-hmm. They did their thing with this. Mm. You can tell the 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 um the man that made these, his name was Bo. Mm-hmm. Mm. Bo made these rib tips. This is good. Woo! And these rib beans, the rice cake from Popeyes, y'all. Probably shared that already. But this food is good right now. Okay. That's what I was saying. So my first, my one of my worst dates, I'm gonna tell y'all. <laughs> I kind of told y'all <laughs> about one, but mm. this one was with a girl, okay. And we decided to meet up at the bowling alley. And y'all, I'm real good at bowling, okay. I was on a bowling team in high school, real good at it. We get there. And red flag one was she wanted me to pay for the first game. And then she was like, I'll pay for the second game. Now, everybody know one game is damn near enough. You don't feel me? You don't really need two games, but <clears throat> my dumb ass. Okay. Let's do it. So, we're getting our balls or whatever. She got her ball. I got mine. Sis kept using my ball, and it was just me and her playing. So, when your turn's over, it's immediately my turn. I have to wait for my ball to come because you just use my stuff. Why can't you go get your own ball? Y'all, it's just etiquette. It just pissed me off. So, y'all, hold on. Mm -mm -mm. This pot is good. It's got to warm it up. Definitely got to warm it up. So we playing, okay. of course I'm winning. But like she low key like getting real competitive. It was just such a turn off cause I'm just like, it's not even that kind of party. I'm just genuinely good at bowling. I'm not about to dumb myself down for you. The fuck? Mm -mm. So, we almost end the game. And you know at the end of the game you get to go like three times, so. Mm. She went one of my turns, and I think she did it on purpose. That's what really made me mad. Oh my god, y'all, that made me so mad. Like, you are messing my game up, fam. Especially when I really want to win. So then, she, <laughs> she's like, oh my bad, I didn't mean to. I might as well just bow for you. You might as well bow for me. No, bitch, I'm gonna finish my round, even though you just bow for me. So, I bow, and I get my score. I don't even remember what the score was, but of course I'd be here, but. Her turn. So I'm about to roll her turn. <clears throat> Ooh, excuse me. I'm about to roll one of her turn. And then she wanna catch an attitude. A real life attitude, y'all. After I pay for the shit. She wanna catch an attitude. After she done bowled my stuff. After she done used my ball. I can't, I can't. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, oh, okay. As long as that's what we're doing right now. So then. I'm like, I'm about to argue with you over a turn. Ain't nobody arguing, baby girl. Ain't nobody arguing. Bitch, I ain't your baby girl. Like, I'm so turned off right now. I'm like, so turned off. So, when the janitor was walking past, he was like, is everything all right, ladies? And I'm like, of course, you feel me? She kind of snitched and was like, if somebody takes your turn, do you get to go for their turn? Bitch, are we in second grade right now? Like, y'all, yeah, I start putting my shoes on. Ain't no second grade. Ain't no second grade. I put my shoes on. I was in my stomach hurt. Can't take me home. And y'all, I left. Never talked to her again. Mm -mm. I really wanted to fight her and throw her ass down that aisle. I don't get it. Like, when you play in a sport, it's all about etiquette sometimes, yo. And especially when it comes to bowling, like, you have to wait for the other person to get done bowling. Like, just give them, them some space. Mmm. Yo, I am done. Flip me over. Put me in some buns, honey. I'm done. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let me down 
in the comments if you guys have any like words for the date stories or just any bad date stories and make sure you guys follow me on instagram and tiktok and i'm gonna definitely catch out my next video peace